I recently read the book Big Magic, Creative Living Beyond Fear. It was recommended to me by Laura, so of course I took her advice and I connected really strongly with the author Elizabeth Gilbert's views on how creativity and fear are like conjoined twins. You cannot separate the two. No matter how hard you try, fear will always be there. But through diligence and discipline, you will find inspiration. In watching Laura work over the years, I've been inspired by how she embraces fear and uses diligence and discipline to create big magic. I wanted to share a little bit of her process, so in the following interview, you'll learn a little bit more about Laura. So, what on earth is going on here? <laughs> Can you explain this madness? I'm doing a window installation in Toronto during the Toronto Design Outside Festival. And it's going to be a, um, a metal grid, this metal grid, woven with zip ties. Yeah, those zip ties back there. So, on the Toronto Design Offsite Festival website, if you scroll all the way to the bottom, you find Zip Tie Tapestry. I had to name it with something with a Z, that's a mistake. But... Yeah, but it's here. So, what it says, if I may read this, sure. is that okay? Go for it. Alright, thank you. Uh, Zip Tie Tapestry is an exploration of traditional textile techniques using unconventional materials. That's pretty awesome. By the way, let's rewind a little bit. Let's go back. I don't know. All the previous videos have sort of been about travel and kind of random shenanigans. I mean, this is a bit of a shenanigan, but just to let you guys know, we haven't really talked about what we do. Laura's a product designer at Umbra. She's done a lot of really cool stuff. Just Google Laura Carwardine. Umbra, they'll find some awesome <laughs> products. The pendant is my personal fave. Yeah. Yeah, really cool. Let's show that one. It's a nice product, good job on that. Thanks so much. And this is a side project though, so Laura likes to get into side projects every once in a while. This is exciting. I'm so glad you're starting another... Crazy project. Crazy project. <laughs> well, hopefully it doesn't take as long as the last one, so we'll see. Yeah. We'll see. And the last one, if you want to see, I'll put a link below. Something kind of in this realm. Different materials, a little bit bigger, different application. Yeah. But, but I'm excited to try. It's been a little while since I've done something kind of in this realm, so I'm excited to try something with different materials and different colors. And yeah. And I, you've been interested in playing with textiles and scale of textiles for a very long time, right? Mm-hmm. Like dating back to school and yeah. way back, yeah. way, way back. Yeah. We don't have to get into that now. But if you want to see this piece live when it's done, where can people go to see that? It's going to be at Zane on Queen West in Toronto. Um, I don't know the address. I can try it. It's right here. Oh, you have it. 753 Queen Street West in Toronto. Yeah. So check it out. It's a cool store too. <laughs> yeah. Zane is an awesome shop. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very cool. All right. Well, you want to get started? So bad. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> if you haven't already, please hit subscribe. Hit the little bell so that you'll get notifications when I post videos. Also, check out these two videos. Laura's cross stitch project that she executed about five years ago. It's massive. It's like over 400 square feet. Really cool. And then also the more recent zip tie tapestry video. Thanks very much for watching.